So when it comes to filling out an NCAA tournament bracket, some rely on luck while others put their knowledge of basketball to the ultimate test. And for me, it'll be luck. I know it'll be knowledge for you. <laughs> News Channel 18's Krista Henry spoke to fans who say having the perfect bracket is just not possible. While the NCAA tournament gets into full swing Thursday and Friday with 64 teams in action, fans are already in action and filling out their brackets, hoping for their own victory. Uh, when I do, it's, it's always a great time because, you know, I'm only right about a half a time, but uh, I think that's pretty much uh, the way it is for everybody. I always try to put one upset for the one seed, and I decide to go with Detroit. A lot of it is, you know, your favorites. You pick a little bit further than maybe they should go, so I always have the Boilers going to the final, final four, being a Purdue grad. My strategy is to pick my school to go all the way. I'm a Buckeye fan, so it's Ohio State all the way. While some fans say they simply just pick their favorite teams, News Channel 18's Caleb Martin says he follows his own strategy. How the teams have played during the season, who they've played, have they beat anybody really big on their schedule, and I also really like to look at are they on a winning streak. But the question is, is there a perfect way to pick the winning bracket? I've been doing it uh, 28 years since my sophomore year in college. This is how many times I've won. Never. So if our very own sports expert hasn't brought home the gold in the bracket games yet, maybe there's not a so-called right way to pick. But whether you're just trying to beat the odds and win the jackpot, others say they're simply just doing it for the fun behind the brackets. I don't do it for money, I just do it for fun, and I do it in online contests. Krista Henry, News Channel 18.